Hello, this is the uh, first time I'm servicing this uh, France oil filter. And uh, I don't know how many miles is on it, but I wanted to just change the cartridge and uh, uh, get, get the first uh, dirty one out of it. Band clamp on here. The V clamp, much like a turbo clamp would have. Just uh, loosen it up. And I took the uh, return line off and I set it down on the bottom into a drain pan hoping it won't leak. Do a little twist, pull it up off of there, it leaked a little. So I want to set this on my drain pan and let it drip out for a while. I didn't put a towel down there to catch any spillage. So I'll be back here in just a few minutes and you can watch me uh, take this thing apart. But it's got some, some oil down in it. Okay. I've uh, let this drip for about five minutes. And the oil's not running out of it no more. So I need a little screwdriver. This is the first time I've done this, so so be be a little patient here. I'm trying to figure this out. There's a a ring in here I got to dig out. She went to grab me a screwdriver. I guess it holds the uh, paper from coming down too low. There's a pull handle. I don't know if you can see it, but it's a big wire wire hook to pull this paper out with. I'm going to set it over here on my uh, little pan to the side of me so it doesn't leak all over. I'm going to flip it upside down because I want to feel the surface see if there's any dirt on it. I don't know if that's dirt stuck in the bottom or not, but I'm going to wipe it out because I'm going to show you these uh, two rolls I have. And it might take a little effort to get this uh, uh, roll to put in. That looks like it's just uh, part of the casting. I'd say this probably has about six to eight hours of uh, run time on it. Here's the uh, paper they sent with it. The guy I got these from in California sells them, but I think uh, according to his distributor that he just simply rebrands re this paper from somewhere else that's not uh, official paper. And it should fit just in here. Might have to peel just a little bit off until you get to a tight fit. They told me to use Scott 1000, which is uh, similar to this. This is a uh, store brand of the, the same uh, variety, same size. So, 
one ply tissue. Well, obviously it's quite a bit too big, so we're going to have to peel some off and we'll just have to see how much it takes. By the way, it was 99 cents at the grocery store. This is a little bit of emergency reserve. I got it so it's a little tight going in, which it should, it should work out all right. Don't forget to put this wire thing in, this uh, pull hook. one of coffee cans. It's a tight fit. That's probably what you want so it doesn't leak past it. I say to use a coffee can for a pusher. Like I said, this is my uh, first time doing this, so I'm learning just like you. So wiring. Not really a groove for it, but some, I guess it holds the paper lips so now. I don't really know. That, that's what it looks like so far. And we'll break a minute and I'll, we'll put it back on the canister. Okay. Got the uh, paper here. Closer look at what it looks like inside little handle here and the uh, steel ring there's no groove for it so I didn't somehow it holds the paper from coming down too low I, I don't really know also a, a steel steel tube right here that makes up the gap for this uh, cardboard thing so it doesn't leak past it that that's a new uh, technology they come up with because the, the rolls are different size now there's two different sizes of that I don't really know that that's the one they supplied with it and it feels it's not real tight on here but it, it should be all right and I took no effort to push that down
Took my oil line loose a little bit grip out. But I don't think I really needed to do that. This will take probably a, a quart to refill it. Maybe a little less. There's the uh, filter. It's uh, it's really saturated. I'm gonna let it sit there and drip out about all day. And uh, I might peel a little paper off, see if I can feel any dirt in it. But um, they don't have a lot of a lot of hours on it. I just wanted to uh, uh, get the first dirty one out and then see what it looks like and uh, figure out how this process works. And uh, thanks for watching this.